Hello everybody, Ultra Mario here, and welcome to Danny Phantom, the Ultimate Enemy. Uh, Game Boy Advance. I've been watching the series again recently, pretty cool stuff. You know, I watched it a bit as a kid, so, you know, that and it's the 20th anniversary. So what better time than to play this game now? Wow, sprite work's looking cool. Freaking hyping it up over here. Why, why doesn't Danny have his emblem though? I don't know. That's what season two, like after, you know, he already had it, so. Plus, Dark Danny has it right now. What is going on? Anyway, I'll start the game in one second. Let me just check the bonuses real quick. Oh, we got all the characters at the bottom there. Okay, got a bunch of ghosts here. I'll, I'll read all this later. Passwords. Okay, that's cool. Burger King promotions? BK? I'm assuming that's, you know, is Burger King. It, it's definitely Burger King. Bruh, I don't know how you get that. But, anyway, I'm gonna start the game now. For real this time. I always check the options before I actually play games. That's just how it be. Um... I don't know. Just do UM. I'll just do ult for ultra. Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure. Amity Park. Ten years from now, the future world is in ruins. Uh, okay, wait. Let me... How do I freaking make save states on this? I just wanna... Remember here. Okay, shift F1. Yeah. A powerful ghost shield built to protect the city was able to hold off. The ghost invasion for a while, and chill. <laughs> you think this shield would keep me out? Forever? I was able to break the shield with my latest ghost power. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. You're telling me I get to play as freaking Dark Danny? Holy crap. That's actually fire. It's a uh, standard beam up. Pretty cool stuff though. Bro, why does his sprite look like that though? Uh, I don't know, he looks goofy. Okay, hold up. So, it's a beat him up platformer kind of deal here. I guess. Okay, wait. Let me just get my stream on my phone so I can get to the chat here. Ah. How do I get... Oh, okay, here's the chat. Honestly, I want to switch X and Y, but... What am I supposed to do? Bro, this game is freaking crazy. Oh, okay, you just have to hit it two billion times. Mo oh, experience? They got they got freaking experience in this. Oh crap, it's Valerie. What is going on? The ghost shield can't be broken? Hello, Valerie. Like the new power? I call it my ghostly whale. Dan Fanta Bro, Dan Fanta? And goodbye. Bro, they're actually calling him Dan Phantom? <laughs> what the hell? And... Can't believe the game has me playing as the antagonist. Bro, I'm actually fighting here. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Uh, I mean, okay, the sprites in the actual, you know, gameplay could be better, but... The other stuff is fine. Bro, spam call, go away, I'm trying to freaking play Danny Phantom here. Okay. 
Bro, they like lock you with hit stun or something. He's freaking dead, guys. That took me 39 seconds. Zerbo one. This older Johnny Phantom will take over Amity Park in the future. I don't remember what they sound like because they were only in one episode, so. He has become very powerful. He has become too powerful. Danny will become a threat to us all. We must stop this from happening. I can see a different future for Danny Fenton. I will make sure he never becomes evil. Meanwhile, I Casper High. Tomorrow is the CHE exam. I need to get home and study. I don't really know how to do Danny's voice. Bro, the sprites look so goofy. Danny, I don't know where they came from, but the school's filled with ghosts. Danny, we all know you're going to grow up to begin be a ghost hunter. A ghost hunter isn't a real career path. Yeah, I can't I can't do Danny's voice, guys. I'm just you know doing generic voice number five. No, I'm I'm Mr. Dan Phantom himself. I wonder if you unlock more moves as the game goes, because so far, you know, it's kinda a little bit mindless, but it's still kind of fun. It's also funny seeing the sprites and how crunchy they look. Hopefully the next Danny Phantom game has slightly better visuals. I don't know, like the backgrounds look good and the ghosts look good, but like... Why does his face look like this and why doesn't he have his freaking emblem? I am swear to god. This triggers me on an emotion level. Bro, you can even beat people up with freaking lightsabers. Okay, never mind. That's the peak. Wait. I, oh, 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 I can use the... Uh, I don't know. They don't explain any of this. Bro, I can do, like, all sorts of stuff, apparently. Okay, never mind. This isn't as mindless as I thought. I have, like, a bunch of things I can switch to. Oh, I can fly. Didn't really know that. Oh, crap. Okay, so I can stay in the air. I don't know what this random thing is. We're in Amity Park now. I don't know how this works. Wait, I could just turn back to regular daddy? Why would I need to do any of that? Yeah, I'm gonna kick ass with Danny himself. I still don't know how the Fenton Thermos works, guys. I doubt anybody is gonna know what to do though, so... I mean, who's watching freaking Danny Phantom the Ultimate Enemy on Twitch in 2024? Who knows? I may be surprised. Oh, oh, okay. There we go. Busting out the moves now. Oh, he has like a special meter. Bruh. Ow. Okay, now that I know how to do other stuff, the game is more fun. I just thought it was mindless one attack stuff, since this is just like a simple kids game, but... I mean, it's got a bit more to it than I thought. Oh 
Okay. Bro, I got a level up. Does that mean I got new moves? Yo, okay. I actually, do it does have a freaking combat. Going to jump, press the control pad down and the B button. Okay. Bro, he's just going from level to level against a bunch of ghosts. Oh, I have to turn invisible. Right? Wait, how do I... Ow. What if I have no freaking skill powers? Unless I have to beat all the ghosts and then I can get past the wall. Okay. No, legit, what am I supposed to... They definitely want me to use this invincibility power, invisibility power up. I just don't know how it works. Okay, so if I'm normal Danny, that actually charges my, like, ghost powers or something. Okay, I get that. Okay, okay, okay. I get it now. Cool. So there is a purpose to normal Danny. It's like basically a recharge. I guess, I mean, to be fair, if you're not in your ghost form, it might help rush your abilities or something. I don't, I don't know, man. Logic. Okay. I'm learning. I'm learning the game as I go. Not too crazy so far. Never played this, so... I don't know. Good thing it charges fast, though. The sprites are going on me a bit. They look goofy, but they're funny. I like them. They're goofy, but charming. Bro, now we're in the frickin' cafeteria. Bro, he's doing the freaking. Okay, this is epic pose. I forget that I can fly sometimes. Not that, you know, it's very strong, but like... Oh, you can dash too. Okay, any beat-em-up should have that, honestly. Pad down, control pad down, and the R button. I'm never going to have time to study with all these ghosts around. Danny, what are you doing? You should really be studying if you want to be past your CAG. Okay, I get it. You're brilliant, and I'm stupid, and I'll never be able to get as high a score on my CAT as you did. 
Jess, get out of my room. I think I sense something weird. There's something in the house. Okay, I don't want to hear about it. <laughs> ha ha ha. Sonny will have to wait. The ghost faces through the wall outside and Danny follows her. Oh yeah, I haven't made one save state yet. Okay, shoot him up level. Bruh. Bruh. Okay, that's kind of funny, actually. Oh, whoa, I can do freaking Kamehameha Blast in this level. giving me a run for my lunch money. Uh, I'm so funny. Okay, hold on. Why do I keep pausing? I just like taking the screenshots. Oh man, I'm, I'm losing. I'm losing this. I think I can get out though. Oh, uh, no boss fight? Who are you? I am Box Lunch, daughter of the Box Ghost and the Lunch Lady. You know, honestly, freaking... I'm pretty sure the dialogue's all just lift straight from the episode. Not that that surprises me, but... Ew, that's just gross. Prepare to taste the beach. Maybe you would like a nice salad with that? I think I'll pass. Oh, that's funny. Okay. Imagine if somebody played this before they watched the episode. It'd be kind of funny, honestly. It'd be so confused. Well, not really confused, but like... Eh, they, they, they skip quite a bit of the story for this, you know, game. No, we need to recharge in the middle of a fight. So I'm just gonna go regular Danny. Honestly, I just want to throw hands, so... Spam laser blasts. Okay, that didn't help that much. Box Lunch has a pretty cool design, though. I was able to get rid of Box Lunch, but the fight caused the Nasty Burger sauce to explode! Looks like their new sauce is unstable. Danny, are you okay? That was some explosion. I'm totally covered in sauce. Now, wow, look what I found. A strange medallion. Tucker, check it out. Danny, there's something stuck on your back. It's the CA team e exam answer sheet. There, he found the test answers and we planted. Bro, they planted it there. He will surely cheat on the test, and when he does, his future will be changed and he will become evil. Okay, then why did you plant it on his back, you idiots? We don't know that for sure. He's also found the time immunity to medallion that was on box lunch. That is rather unfortunate. Let me take a look at that medallion. Looks almost as if it were futuristic. This thing doesn't look like it's from here. So, Danny, what about the CIT exam answers that we found? You're not thinking about looking at the test answers, are you? Why shouldn't I open this up? Why shouldn't I open this up and study the answers? Skulltech 9.9. .9. Ha ha ha! I'm going to follow that ghost. Chuck, Tucker, Sam, see what you can do about it. 
that medallion. Bro, the freaking bending portal is just static. Unmooping. Oh, offense up. What? Bro, they have a freaking. C instead of an S. Is, is this the European version? I don't know, man. I mean, the. The, the startup of the game is with the UK for black, so I probably should have been tipped off by that, but... I thought that I just had to do with the fact that it's the English language. Won't matter that much, though. Near the Nasty Burger. Who are you supposed to be? I am Skull 9.9, .9, the future girl's world's greatest hunter. If it's Skulker we are up against, I can hack him and him, hack into him with my PDA. Thanks, Tucker. Skull check 9.9. 9 .9. Prepare, better prepare yourself. Rats, can't control my body. What are you doing? Let's get out of here. And I honestly always thought Skull, uh, Heck, this was voiced by freaking Gilbert Gottfried, but no, he just kind of sounds like it. It's still, it's just Rob Paulson. Bro, how come I always have to charge this stupid crap? more variety of ghosts. That's my main complaint right now. They're just fighting the same guides over and over. I mean, at least there's the occasional random lightsaber to make things fun. How many worlds are there? Bruh, really? Real. This random game over because I didn't fly. I'm expected to know how to fly. Remember kids, if Danny falls, it's just over for him. Apparently. That's how it works. You can't just, you know, fly back or something. He just instantly dies. Full power. Okay, I think they want me to fly in this level. The finger gun attack is pretty cool, though. Even if not the most useful. Damn it, I can't do the charge in the air. Bro, I swear to god with these spam calls. Bro, stop. Okay, hold up. Actually, yeah, the audio's still working.
Bro, there's so many of these stupid ghosts. Maybe that's just the power I haven't unlocked yet. Bro, how many random levels are there in this game? Oh, the freaking Spectre Deflector. Oh, the freaking uh, C instead of S is triggering me with this spelling here. Freaking British spelling. Time to use the pummeler. It has no effect on you in the future, but it will work on you now. The future? What are you, are you talking about? Oh, I need to charge again. Imagine Danny just sees this guy, and his in the first, you know, instinct is just, you know, go normal, Danny. Oh crap, whoa, that's sick actually. Wow, oh, okay. He might actually put up quite a fight. Okay. Um I might die. Okay, the game just starts you right off the fight anyway. Okay, I have no idea how to get away from him. Oh god. He's actually hard. Oh, okay. Yeah, when he's about to use that attack, just run the hell away. Freaking got the Doc Ock arms here. Damn, the Danny game for little babies is hard, guys. Okay, if I stall him enough, I should be able to win. Provided, you know, I can actually dodge his attack. No. Okay. Is he just gonna stand there while I shoot him? The 
This is how you do it, guys. This is how you win. Very tediously freaking stall him. With my ghost gun fingers. Okay, fine, I'll fight him like a man. Or not. I'm gonna shoot him. It's fine. Bro, what is he doing? Okay, is that even doing any damage to him, actually? Shit. Skull Tech 99 is hard, man. Okay, screw this guy. I don't know how anyone is supposed to legitimately beat him, though. Like, without, you know, safe states or something. I mean, it might be possible. It's just really hard. The thing I can think of is just punch him a lot. Because that that's the thing doing actual damage, not my stupid pea shooter. But the problem is he pulls out his frickin' octopus arms really fast. It's very hard to dodge. Okay, okay, I got the hang of this, guys. I'm gonna win. Just watch. Okay, immediately gets freaking jobs by his arms of death. Suddenly, the shooter is doing a lot more damage. He just died in midair. Man, that was tough. Oh, attack power. Awesome, Janie! You trash that oversized ghost! Thanks to you! Look, Janie, Skull Tech 9.9 .9 has a medallion too! So, Box Lunch and Skull Tech 9.9 .9 are ghosts from the future. It must be the medallions. They are allowing those go these ghosts to tra travel through time! Oh, I see. When the ghosts lost their medallions, they were sent back to their own time. That's why they disappeared. They have defeated Skull Tech 9.9! .9. Now they're using the power of time medallions to travel here. We have no choice but to stop Danny ourselves now. Inside Clockwork Slayer. Where are we? I don't know. The Ghost Zone, I think. But no part of the Ghost Zone I've ever seen. We were transported here when we put the medallions on. You guys wait here while I check this place out. Okay, come on, Sam. Let's see what we can find out. Bruh. Who am I gonna fight here? Bruh. There shouldn't even be freaking villains and Clockwork's lair, but okay, sure. Let's spam them. Makes me wish Danny Phantom had a console game. Apparently that was a plan for, uh, um, Brainstorm or whatever the freaking second game is called. Jungle Storm? I don't know. But...
Music's pretty generic, sadly. I can tell. Damn it, no spectre deflectors this time. The lightsabers would kill me. Oh god. Damn it. Okay. Okay, I'm back on level one by accident. Yo! I got the freaking battle gauntlet stuff that uh, Jack Benson has in some of the episodes. I feel like fighting the enemies is annoying too, but. Yeah, at least it's fun to play with this power up. good weapon for this stage actually. Considering, you know, it'll work well on the ghost in midair. Echo Bazooka, or whatever it is. Damn, that's a good weapon. No. Damn it. Oh, no, I still have it. No, I don't. Oh my god. I swear to God. Bro, they're not even hitting. Okay, what's that gonna do here? Nothing, because it's gonna careen me off a cliff. Wow, what a good weapon. If I combo too much, it's just gonna kill me. Why? Okay. 
What a useless weapon. I was supposed to- I'm expected to just do like half the combo here. Oh, bro, I swear. Why- why did- why does it have the freaking insta kill you? Other beat em ups just have you like lose health or something. So stupid. This isn't a game on the NES, this isn't Double Jack and 2 or whatever. You don't need to die instantly. Well, this game's pissing me off. Okay. At least you can use this weapon in the air. I say as I plummet to my doom. Oh god. How big is Clockwork's lair? I feel like most levels have at least three, you know, most worlds have three levels. Yo. No, that's four levels. There's a lot of padding in this game, that's for sure. I'm like, how do they make a whole ep game out of a single episode? That's this is how. You just have the same stuff over and over. you learn the ghastly whale in this game. That would make sense. Bro, it keeps going.
finally. Skull cap- 9.9 disappeared! I didn't do that. I did. Who are you? Where are we? I am Clockwork, Master of Time. I'm trying to change your future, Danny Phantom. I, in your future, you become evil, and I cannot let that happen. Me? Become evil? That will never happen. It's only a matter of time before you become evil. Bruh, his face. Let me show you something. Bro, the boss fight. He's not even trying to fight me because he's not a bad guy. Bro, he's just swinging that thing at me. He's not even using his time powers. The evidence doesn't lie. The CAG ex exam answers. Danny cheating on the exam caused this? Danny, looks like the CAG exam was your turning point. Look yourself in the future, Danny. You have lost your humanity and become totally evil. I was fighting with the police and the army. How terrible. I tried to change your past to alter your future. What I did hasn't made a difference. You will still become evil. The only, only po other possible option is for you here and now no way to the future come on guys what's this Dan Phantom's back wait there seems to be two of them I hope we can stop two of them finally you are here Johnny I've been waiting for you is that how they differentiate him they just call him Dan Phantom instead of Dan why man this is what we have to look forward to in the future Definitely not going to let Danny cheat on, on his test. Okay, they don't even mention the fact that they die in the future. Y you know. Because it's a kid's game. You can't mention that even though they said it in the episode. Oh, this is cool actually. Bro, the same exact ghost in the future? Not even any new ones. You have to literally fight the same guy the whole game. Oh, well that... The freaking gray one was kind of new. Like how they integrate the tools from, you know, the various episodes of the show, though. Ghost fighting weapons and stuff. Okay, that's it. I'm recharging. I don't feel like fighting all these guys. Actually sick. Oh, finally, a new enemy, and he looks cool. That's the guy from the opening of the freaking show. That isn't actually in any episodes. Actually. Oh, 
know this offense up is sick. Not bad so far. This is horrible. In the future, I'm the one responsible for all of this. Got that right, ghost! Valerie, I can't believe it's you! I've been looking forward to this day for a long time, Phantom. Say goodbye! I think the game just... What? What is happening? Bruh. It crashed. Oh, no. It's it's fine now. You know what? I could probably just beat her normally without any extra lasers or something. She's just a human. She's not that strong. Not like Skull Tech 99. Bro, if Skull Tech was that hard, imagine how dark Dark Danny's gonna be. Okay, she's a little strong, actually. What? Why? It keeps doing that. A few moments later. Test! Okay, I think everything's working again, probably. Oh wait, not my controller. Never mind. No, nope. Re restart everything. Oh, no, there it goes, there it goes. Never mind, we're good, we're good. Okay, this time I'm gonna kill Valerie too. Well, not really, but... Wow, the combos, bro. Okay. Visual Boy Advance really did not want me to win this fight. Because it waited out like twenty three times and messed up the PC, so I had to restart everything. My computer to get everything to work. Valerie, have you lost your mind? Don't shoot! Sam? Tucker? It's not possible. You can't be alive. Oh, okay, never mind. They, they didn't they didn't cheap out on that. What do you mean? Sam and I died? It was all Danny's fault. Actually, that was me. Bro, his eyes look like Dr. Robotnik in this game. Dan Phantom. Bro, I, I swear, in like a script for this episode or something, did they just call him Dan Phantom? Because, but why, why does she keep calling him that? I, I don't get it. Okay, wait. No. My, my thing's messing it up. Hold up. Test. Okay, everything's working. Just gotta get the controller back up here. Then these guys did come from the past? Looks like clockwork is meddling with time again. Clockwork caused this mess? It looks like you caused it. You mess causer. It's been 10 years. Let me introduce you to your future. You? That's a lie. You can't be me. Tucko, Sam, take the medallions off, quick. They vanished. Where'd they go? They took off their time medallions and returned to their time, just like I'm doing right now. Better make that medallion a little more permanent. The time medallion is fused inside you. Neither ghost nor human can remove it. Now you can never return to your time. Ah! I'll send you floating so far in the ghost zone that you'll never come back. Oh, 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 wait, no, I'm supposed to lose this far, not a fight, aren't I? Wouldn't that make sense, narratively?
I shouldn't win this fight, I'm just saying. But I might. Might stand a chance, actually. Bro, I beat Dark Annie? Okay. Crisis averted, apparently. He just won. I gotta figure out a way to get out of here and back to my time. I know. The only person who might have the power to get this medallion out of me would be Vlad. Okay, seriously. My freaking controller keeps making the mouse go, like, everywhere, though. Hold up. Okay, I just want to put the game a little out. Oh, yeah, it's like way too low. There we go. Go, no, speed choose. Okay, well, we're in the go zone. That's cool. And finally, some new ghosts, too. At least two of them. Okay, I need my laser spat. Oh, what? That's a new attack. He uses up lots of energy, too. Oh, that's a ghost jail or whatever, I guess. Oh, yeah, I'm probably gonna fight, like, Valerie. Or, sorry, not Valerie. Uh, Ember, Spectra. Wait, no, Spectra wasn't in the special. I forgot. Actually, who was in the special? I don't even remember. If if they're not cowards anyway, they'll they'll make them boss fights. But I don't know. So far, they got like all the characters from the special, though. So basically, all of them. Except Mr. Lancer, for some reason. That's fair, they have their chief out somewhere, after all. No Mr. Lancer allowed. Okay, no. No, no I don't want to restart! What are you doing? Stupid control- okay. Well, hold on again. A lot of weird technical hang-ups here. Okay. Oh, what? New enemy. Uh, goopy goo guy.
Nice. Got him. Oh, that's a Ghost King's castle. I wonder why he never appeared after his like first special. Somewhere here. Oh wow, the music's getting crazy. Oh yeah, I forgot Walker is in this too. He seems fairly normal though. And he's got his ghost goons too. Honestly, is Walker really a fighter? I don't remember him doing that much fighting. And again, he. Really didn't appear in season two, actually. He just—he mostly appeared in like two or three episodes in season one. I think he had like one appearance in season two, maybe. I, I don't know, man. I feel like he was set up to be like more major, but they kind of just, you know, forgot about him. I don't know. Wow, I'm becoming unstoppable now. This B combo on him basically invincible. Wow. Plus my ring. Okay. I was lucky to get out of the ghost zone. Where am I? Come to a kick old lad. Kick a defenseless old man while he's down. Vlad Masters? Man, what happened to you? I could ask you the very same question, my boy. Although perhaps I should ask what's happened to you yet. It was ten years ago. There were two explosions at the Nasty Burger. Your friends and your entire family, gone. There was a second explosion after my fight with Skulltech 9.9? I can't believe it. It was my fault? All you wanted was to make the hurt go away. Even if it meant giving up your humanity. Using the ghost gauntlets, I was able to take your human half out. But you couldn't handle being all ghost. My evil side overwhelmed you. You became 100% evil. Thank you for telling- thanks for telling me. Do you still have the ghost gauntlets? Indeed I have. Just what are you thinking, boy? Use the ghost gauntlets to reach enemy, and maybe you can get the time medallion out of me. Which, by the way, it sounds totally gross. But it could also kill you. I'm sure that you can figure it out, Vlad. Um, 
you can do it, right? What are we waiting for? I'm sensing other ghosts coming this way. This must be Dan Phantom's doing it. I swear to God, if they call him Dan Phantom one more time, I'm gonna be triggered. They, they didn't... I get they want to differentiate him from, like, normal Danny, but, like, well, why Dan Phantom? That sounds stupid. Use the ghost goblins. They pack quite a bunch. Punch. Oh, okay, more levels. Yeah, I want to turn the music up a bit, honestly. Oh, why, why, why does my mouse have to be like this? I just want to turn up the music. Okay. Okay. There we go. I don't know how to use the plasma ring. Are oh, they actually beating me? The green one keeps reminding me, the light green one keeps reminding me of Rough Tower. Damn it. Okay, I'm like halfway through the game, or at least almost done with it, probably. Oh, whoa. Oh, okay. It's a special attack. Bro, freaking gloopy guy over here. I'm lucky Vlad had become the, had the strength to remove the medallion. Sure feels good to be in my own time again. The nasty burger is over that this that way. Gotta make it in time to save my family. Oh yeah, this is like the ending almost. Oh, so we gotta have another random shoot 'em up stage. First one. To be fair, Danny can fly, so they gotta take advantage of that somehow. This is the laziest way they can do that, so... Well, not laziest, but like, cheapest way. I mean, not saying that shoot 'em up games are like, you know, cheap. It's just, you know, it seems kinda easy to make a mediocre one. You just move around, hold A, and shoot. And then the enemies have, like, you know, patterns that, you know... 
I, I, I don't know. I'm not a game designer, but it seems like it'd be pretty easy to make. At least, like, a basic shoot em up. Hey, old man! Your time is up, Johnny. It's been up for ten years. So it wasn't cheating on the CAT that turned me evil. It was the death of my family. Yes, and I'm here to make sure that everything happens like it's supposed to. I can't let my family and friends die again. I have to get to the new, unstable, nasty burger sauce. It's what caused the explosion that killed them. No, you don't! Okay. Damn, this is raw. Oh, crap, I get to play Dark Danny. Bruh, his health is that small? Okay, his attacks are strong. That's how he makes up for it. Bro, I'm infinite him. Let's go. I'm cheaty. That power! The ghostly will! It's not but You don't even see him use it in the actual game. I don't get that power until 10 years from now. I guess the future isn't as set in stone as you think it is. Anyway, you are too late. You're about to witness history. Oh man, I can't transform. I'm out of energy. Time out. Clockwork, you stop time. I cannot let this happen. I have sent the future to end Phantom to its time, so that I cannot affect this past. Once you start your time again, there will be no explosion, and my friends and family will be fine. I mean, the way it's supposed to be. Mr. Phantom, is there a problem? Well, I found this the other day at Nasty Burger. Mmm, the seal is broken. I'm sorry, but I'm not a cheater, and I never will be. Well, you'll have a chance to prove that when you take the make- the- the makeup test. Why- why is he saying that? Like, with the next week. Really? Yes! Congratulations! Thanks! The end. That- that's how you're- they end the game. They just say, the end. Oh, yeah, top 10 bangers of all time. It's cool that they got the credits Im images, uh, like, in the show. Yeah! Frickin' off-tune main theme variant here. They probably didn't have the license to use the actual theme song, so they just have this. Bro, that game took, like, oh my god, Mario! Guess maybe the game was in development while Danny still didn't have his emblem. I mean, that, uh, Ultimate Enemy was an early season 2 episode. Like, maybe, like, somehow there were just, like, you know, the episodes without the emblem. I don't know. Why doesn't he have it? Who knows? Remember, maybe this game was made before they settled on the final design. But, Dark Danny has it, so, who knows? Alright, well, that was a cool game. I mean, nothing special, just a basic beat-em-up, but I mean, it was neat. Wonder if they give you anything after the game. I mean, they have the freaking Burger King codes, apparently. Oh, sorry about that. Anyway, nothing, you know, nothing special, but, you know, it was a good time. You know, especially for people who like the show. Like, it's got enough of that for fans to be entertain with, but it's like... Yeah. 
kind of basic. Uh, sorry, I have to pick this up. Excuse me. Japanese people were behind this game? That's kind of interesting, actually. I wouldn't have, wouldn't have thought. Yeah, they got freaking all these people. Interesting. Bro, they talked about all these marketing people first, and then they talk about the people that made the actual game. Okay, that, that picture is pretty cool, actually. Alright, I'm slowly painting out. Secret passwords, lad, question mark. Okay. Is this the post game? Not that I would do post game of this. I didn't, I didn't, I don't find it that interesting to play again, but it was neat to go through once. Maybe it's like a cheat code. Or maybe a Vlad is playable. Okay, what the hell does that do? It just kicked me back. You can unlock the difficulty select. Cool. Not playing this again, but cool. You can unlock the easy mode. Also, uh, you know, just to end it off, I'm gonna read the ghost gallery here. Box of ghosts. This dangerous coat keeps coming. Let me go. Slow but very tough. El Matador. Seriously, watch out for this. Bat ghost. How's it about? Don't underestimate the small flying ghost. Devil ghost. Breathes ghostly fire from far away. Dragon ghost. Small but can breathe fire all day long. Cooling ghost. Heads up. This ghost attacks from above. Splatter ghost. Bro, they have all these ghosts, but they don't have the green ghost in the opening. The sack of goo is gross. Scaredy ghost. I don't even know this enemy. This no enemy never- This is a real one. Don't let it get away. Freaking fish. Attacked by using his hand as a whip. Ghost police. They watch over the ghost zone. Fox ghost wasn't even the game. Powerful- Fox ghost. Powerful in the future. Still a total moron. Yeah, I was gonna say, they don't have Ember or the other people as bosses. Lunch lady. Fox lunches mother. Likes when people eat meat. Skulker. The greatest hunter in all of the ghost zones. Man. Don't tell me they're locked behind hard mode. Damn you. Well, I guess I won't know. The self-proclaimed ghost master of science and electrical technology. Dan Phantom. Danny Phantom grows up to be the world's most powerful ghost villain ever. Skulker and Technus combine. Use the grappling hook. This ghost warden will, d will do anything to enforce the rules. Box lunch and box ghost and lunch lady's daughter has both their powers. Ember is hard barking. Wait, she just looks normal in this game. Bruh, marketability again. Clockwork. Controls the watches over time. Wait, what do you mean, Vlad? Half ghost, just like Danny. Becomes a sad old man in the future. Meat monster. Usually attacks in a group and can keep back from coming up. What? Uh, how the hell? What does dark... What does hard mode do? Ah, oh, no, these guys aren't in the game. They're just here. This ghost looks anything but normal. Any ghost. Angry ghost. Aggressive flying ghost. Look out. Bright night. The spirit of Halloween. One of Dan's men now. What, what, what do you mean, Dan? Oh, Dark Danny. 
Johnny 13. Lost his bike in his t lower limbs to a bad accident. Jenny. Johnny 13's girlfriend. She tries to take over Jazz. Zipper 1 2. These are ghosts who want to stop Dan by. Dan. By killing Danny. Alright, well. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching this stream. If you like what you saw, feel free to follow and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Links on the sidebar. Post all my Twitch bot content there, including a other, other stuff such as Mario, Sonic the Hedgehog, Pizza Tower, and a ton of other licensed games like this one. So, that sounds cool. Feel free to check it out. Anyway, have yourselves a fantastic day and take care. Um. On tomorrow's stream, I'll be doing Danny Phantom, the... What, what, what's that freaking game? Urban Jungle. That's what it was. Anyway. Have a, um, have a good one.